Welcome back to Alumni Field. I'm Leo Blavin. Joining me, Alex Rawling. Michigan finishing their series sweep of the Rutgers Scarlet Knights. The final score today, 8-0 in five innings of work. Megan Betts, the starting pitcher for Michigan, continued her dominance in the circle. The strikeout leader had all her pitches working for her today. Uh, the Rutgers offense had a lot of trouble putting really anything together, whether it be solid swings or balls in play. So Betsa was really dominant for the Wolverines today. And Betsa will look to continue that form come Big Ten tournament time. Sarah Driesinger, the fifth-year senior, came in the circle to finish things off in the fifth inning. Found herself in a bit of trouble, but was able to escape the jam thanks to solid defense from her infielders, including Sierra Romero, getting the out at home plate, and then the runs came for Michigan early and often. Yeah, Tara Blanco had a huge home run uh, to put the Wolverines up big late, and Sierra Romero opened up the scoring with one of the hardest hit softballs I've ever seen. The three-time All-American celebrating her senior day with a solo shot to lead things off, and the scoring continued for Michigan as they reached that eight-run mark to earn that run rule victory in five innings. Michigan celebrated the Big Ten Championship, their ninth straight, which they clinched yesterday. They celebrated today here at Alumni Field. Yeah, the beautiful thing was you could tell all those girls were having fun. A lot of them had won four straight Big Ten championships, and it looked like they had won their first. Uh, it was really great great th to see. It was the beauty of sports. And Carol Hutchins has been here for all nine Big Ten championships. The Wolverines will look for their second straight Big Ten tournament championship next weekend in State College. 